Greetings from the beautiful hills of Shumaria. And, um, well, I'm happy to report today that finally the day has come and I now own this property. Um, these two houses, so on and so forth. That smokehouse there is now mine. And, um, yeah, I came on Monday to pick up the keys, but the people were still moving out. But now I came today and, well, this is my, uh, new house. So there's this front area, a kitchen, and three rooms. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. It's like a kitchen and sort of dining room in the same one. And then there's house number two. <sighs> Fresh air. So this is uh, the old house, about a hundred years old, and um, yeah, another couple of rooms here. Look at this, nice, eh? So uh, <laughs> this is a whole new experience. I've never owned property before, um, let alone with um, you know all this sort of fruit that I'm gonna have to harvest. Um, I got all sorts of different fruits here, so. Um, Join me in the coming days in my uh, new rural adventure, um, owning a house in Shumadia. I don't really have much to say right now um, because I just got here, like literally just got here. And I guess the only other thing I have to say right now is cheers. This is my uh, first, uh, first beer here. And my friend Daryl, um, who helped me buy this house, uh, he lives over there, so I won't be alone here. We're building a uh, village of like-minded people, and I'm, you know, the second, um, the second owner of a property around here to be a like-minded person, I suppose. So this is my fig tree, and I suppose I will figure it out. This whole what to do with all this land and all these like rooms in the houses and stuff like that. To be honest, it's going to take a little bit of time to sort of like uh, take it all in and, and process the information, but uh, I got lots of time and lots of space and lots of fresh air and lots of fruit. Um, so yeah, I'll catch you guys later and I'll update you on how the journey goes.